have finally another update for pixel extended 5.1 which is based on android 13 so let's get started with full review and before we start i just want to thank aditya for building this one let's get into setting and here is the about section and if you can see android version 13 of course and extended version 5.1 as it is pixel extended so don't expect extra customization but we have something so i will talk about that in later and android security update october 5 and which is the latest then we have here the system as usual as it is pixel rom so you guys don't need to worry about any g apps always comes with google play store included in pixel rom so don't worry about any g apps and we have the customization here like system navigation gesture and you guys can customize it according to your choice the pill length i already uh, used it as a big pill and you guys can still make it long and 100 mode is working i checked and the device specific settings and which is important and you can amplify your audio by using headphone gain and microphone gain as usual and if you want to improve your sound quality you guys will get two things here one will be mi sound enhancer and another one thing is moto audio that means dolby audio so here is the dolby audio let me show you that and here is the motor Dolby audio you guys can see and you guys can customize it according to choice like music, movie, game and custom and you guys can see here the pencil icon just click on that that means the edit button and you guys can customize according to your choice so like this and we have here the uh, bass boost and brilliant treble and vocal boost and manual according to your choice you guys can customize it like this which you need you guys can do so we have uh, two sound modes by default in that room which is really really impressive and we have here the digital well-being and other things like pixel uh, security we have only fingerprint as it is uh, initial build that means all android 13 rooms are coming now uh, just this is the very beginning so that's why we don't have any face unlock for now but in future we'll get it don't worry about that we have here the accessibility and other things display and text size you guys can customize and we have the mono audio and audio adjustment is here mono audio can be combined channels when playing audio you guys can also do the audio settings from here and we have the display settings as usual you guys already know about that but we have something here for android 13 and which is screen server the user interface is a bit changed here you guys can see the preview it will look like this then we have the display size and text size and the user interface a bit changed here and bold text and high contrast text can be enabled from here then we have the sound and vibration as usual the regular customizations are here i just don't want to waste your time here and remember one thing previous bugs already fixed in that build so you guys can easily use that rom without any issue and this is of course official rom and if you ask me about the smoothness which is mind blowing and by default you guys will get that uh, two cameras and mostly android 13 rooms are coming with that uh, cameras which one is uh, that black type cameras uh, one and this one google camera which is google camera go you guys will get by default two cameras and of course you guys can use uh, other gcam no problem with that and no complaint against uh, the smoothness which is mind-blowing you guys can see in your eyes next level is smoothness and you guys already know I already told in many videos that when you install a room for the first time just don't be excited for the after first boot uh, the room is very smooth or something if you expect that uh, that's not the thing you have to provide your device for a couple of hours to be set out and to get better smoothness so that's why i always uh, try to say that after installation just keep using your device and after a few hours you will get better performance so let it be settled then it will be okay and now let's talk about the toggles every necessary toggles are available and dark mode night side and everything is here and a screen recorder is working you guys can 
and do screen record no problem and here is the night light which was uh, missing in previous build actually not missing it was a bug in previous build but in that build it's fine so every possible uh, things are solved here no issues right now so i can recommend you guys to use that rom if you want to use in your daily life now let's talk about the cpu throttling and which is 85 percent you guys can see and which is really really great but the geekbench score is a bit lower but i just want to say you guys uh, don't be disappointed because in real life you guys won't face any problem by using this one because i always uh, keep using that don't believe in those scores just keep using your device and real life performance is really matter so there is no issues and not a single lag and stutter in control center is just mind blowing and butter smooth experience now let's talk about the uh, ui of that wallpaper can be selected from here how many wallpaper you have already selected are applied in your home screen and here is the widget section of course you guys will get uh, clock widgets as usual as we have uh, the built-in google play store here so that's why you guys will get the dynamic clock and we have the pixel launcher as we are using the pixel extended room so that's it and now let's talk about the lastly i just want to show you the pixelify or which is uh, pixel extension whatever you say we have some customization like we have the traffic indicators and which is perfectly working no issues with that i already checked everything and volti icon and vo wi-fi and double tap to sleep and wake and everything is just fine and then we have the double tap to sleep on lock screen and media art covered and uh, pulse and ripple effect and screen of udp TFPS, I don't know about that right now. Keep UDFTS enabled when the screen is off. Um, under display fingerprints, something like that, or FPS, or I don't know, whatever it is. Uh, maybe it's uh, FPS, uh, frame per second, of and a display when your display was turned uh, will be turned off. Maybe, I'm not sure about that. So, here is that, and so I have a screenshot. You guys can take that. Actually, the very root customization is available which is very impressive you guys can use in your daily life and important things are included only that's why this is really really smooth room you guys can easily use in your daily life hope you guys like the video if you like my work then do subscribe and hit the bell icon